Look at you. No braces, all the internet you can handle. I wasn't so lucky. Invis is not your parents' braces. Invis is predictable, less painful, more comfortable. Invisalign. Two of the top teams clash on the court as De La Salle hosts Bishop O'Dowd. O'Dowd looking to bounce back after two tough, close losses. And our U.S. Bank inspirational athlete Jalen Lewis will be among those leading the charge. The 6'9 sophomore has had back-to-back 20-plus -back games for the Dragons. For De La Salle, expect to watch standout Chris Bunch. Well, a bunch. On Friday, the junior put up 22 points to help the Spartans come back from a halftime deficit to beat San Ramon Valley. Can the Spartans keep their momentum, or will the Dragons get a big bounce back win? We'll find out in our NCS Monster Game. A good one in Concord Monday night. O'Dowd gets an early lead, down low to Jaron Edwards, takes a power dribble and muscles his way in for the basket. De La Salle making moves, ball deflected in the paint, and Jordan Webster comes up with it, passes out to Johnny Simani, who tosses up to Bill Haggerty for the finish. Second quarter, Jaron Edwards drives in and underhands it through three defenders to Cameron Brown for the bucket. Dragons jump out to a 10-point lead, but the Spartans battle back. Johnny Simani creates a lane, lays it in with just seconds to go, and O'Dowd leads just 23-22 at half. Halfway through the third and Spartans now up by one. Alonzo Washington maneuvers to the basket. De La Salle leads 29-26. Dragons go on a run. Jalen Lewis hits Taj Phillips who launches and the three is good. O'Dowd doing work on both sides of the court. Marcellus Roberson says no. Later Roberson bounces it down to Taj Phillips for the fast break. Dragons back out to a 10 point lead now 41-31. Spartans claw back again. Christian Carter drives and passes out to Joel Bjolman Anders beyond the arc. He shoots. The three is good, but it's 43-47. O'Dowd heading into the fourth quarter. Tie game with two minutes left in regulation and Jalen Lewis down low. Dragons up by two, but with 15 seconds left, Chris Bunch finds an opening and sinks the jumper. We go to overtime 48 all. In OT, Joel Bjolman Anders fights down to the basket and lays it in for De La Salle, but Bishop O'Dowd takes the lead once more and this time they don't let go. Taj Phillips to Jaron Edwards he takes a moment and forces his way to the hoop, gets the layup and one. You see that reaction. The Dragons win 60-52 to in overtime, and Jaron Edwards shares how it feels to finally finish on top in such a close win. It's, it feels good. It feels good that we finally close one out because when you, when you lose a close one, it, it hurts. It stings a little bit. I got the whole team to really focus up, uh, close it out in overtime so we can get back in that uh, win column. In Concord with the Monster Game, I'm Allie Williams, 49ers Cal High Sports.